So guys, the skirts will not be complete without a top or a blouse for it. So I decided to need a short sleeve top for the skirt. So here is 43 by 43 needle. Remember, we are knitting for six months old baby. And I'm going to use this card as a design for chest area. So I'm going to, you know, insert the card and know where the card starts from then. I've already calculated how the design will be at the chest area. So right now, guys, I'm going to select my needle for rib two by one because that's what I use for the skirt. So I'm going to select my needle and cast on by doing a wrap on the two needles each. So then set my tension back to tension six and knit 40 rows this rib with tension six so that's it then i'm using this color right now so changing my tension back to six and i'm going to knit 40 rows and fold so i'm going to knit one row right now and add my comb on it then i will continue to knit till when i knit 40 rows then i will fold it then see you later nah. So guys, after folding, I'm going to set my row counter to zero, zero. Then I'm going to change my tension back to eight. So that's it, guys. Then right now, I'm going to knit 40 rows. So guys, this is 39 right now. I want to use my card. So I'm going to use row 40 to... You know inform my machine i want to knit in punch card so 40 rows right now guys so that's it so right now i'm going to open my card to large so i open it to large because i want the you know the chest design to be at least feasible then right now i'm going to engage my second color then so I'm going to fix the green first, then close the yarn feeder and, you know, insert the milk color. So making sure they are perfectly okay. Then attach the green to the body of the work. So that's it. So here is 40 rows of this background color. So right now I'm going to start to engage my punch card. And start to knit so right now in punch card I'm going to knit 10 rows making the total 50 rows right now so I'm going to press the center button then and start to knit so one so I'm going to engage my comb and add little weight on it So, three, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So, this is 49 rows right now. So, I'm going to, you know, cast off for ham hole at this side then at 50 i'm going to cast off for arm o at this side so i'm casting off six needles for arm o right now then i'm going to go the 50 rows right now then i'm going to repeat the same thing here Casting off six needles for ham 
people at 50 here so guys you can see what we have at 50 we shaped for ample so i'm going to continue in the design right now and you know the row counter is showing me 50 so guys this is the front side that's why it's having chest design so i'm going to go ahead right now and continue knitting till the end of my punch card so 51 52 53 54 55 56 57 58 59 60 51 52 53 54 55 so that's the end of my punch card knitting at the chest area. So the row cancer is at 65. So that is my card work is just 25 rows. You know, it's just 25 rows. So right now I'm going to close up all the setting for, you know, punch card knitting. Then I mean plain knitting, right? now so guys i have five rows to knit before the neck shipping my the neck shipping is 30 rows the total rows of this baby sweater is 100 rows so right now we are at 65 rows so i have five rows to knit and after knitting that five rows that is my row my rows will be 70 rows then i have 30 rows to shape for round neck doing a weight with the green yarn right now then i'm going to go ahead right now and knit five rows that is one two three four five so work at 70 rows so let's see what we have so that's what we have as the design right now it's shaping for the round neck right now i need to bring out you know 25 needles you know to be on hold at this area so i'm going to count one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. So that's 25 needles have to be on hold. Then I'm going to then I'm going to press this to hold so that it can hold this side for me. Then I'm going to need one row right now. that's it then i'm going to cast off 24 needles you know 24 needles that's the center of the round neck so i'm going to cast off 24 needles right now so guys 24 needle is out of the work right now so you can see what we have so this is 24 needle one two three Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four. So that's twenty-four needle. Had twenty-four needles out of the work right now. So at this side, this is one shoulder, and this is the second shoulder so i'm going to work on this right now in which i have 30 rows so i'm going to decrease to and knit 10 rows so i'm going to do that for three times in which i've knitted the 30 rows and 18 needle 
is out of the work at this side and 18 needles is going to be out of the work after finishing at this side so let's see i'm going to decrease right away decreasing and knit 10 rows so decrease the second one and knit 10 rows so that is the last one right now so this is center zero and this is 18 needle you know that is 18 needle is out of work from center zero at the right side or left side So I'm going to use tension 10 and need to use to cast off. So I'm going to go ahead and knit this side. So go back to tension eight. Then I'm going to decrease two needle. I need ten rows. So this have to be here. One. So that's the first one. The second one. The third one that's 30 rows so so tension 10 to cast off so this is what we have guys this is what we have so right now I'm going to show you the back side so this is the back side so this is the back side it's like color blocking knitting so this is the back what you need to do is to knit 40 rows of rib with tension 6 and fold it then you continue to knit you know see you knit 50 rows knit 50 rows and you know cast off for ham or with six needles and continue to knit extra 50 rows so this is 100 rows so knitting the sleeve right now guys i'm going to fix the armhole area on from 40 by 40 needles so i'm going to knit straight 30 rows then with tension eight so going back to tension eight then i'm going to knit straight with color pink yeah so that's it so this is 30 rows guys i'm going to go ahead and select my needle for decrease in three by one needle so i'm going to select it in three by one after selecting three by one and i'm going to leave the empty needle on a position then i'm going to need two rows of pink you know with pink yarn then after then i'm going to knit with waist yarn and fold it then refix it back to knitting machine for the sleeve band you know this is the easier way to decrease your needle so guys you can see what i have here the way i will share my stitches so that you can enter 30 by 30 needle so i'm um, all this one at a position i'm going to give them double stitches they are going to have double stitches and these ones at back they are going to be single stitches so this is 30 by 30 needle so you have to distribute your stitches to make sure that it covers 30 by 30 needles you know it's 40 by 40 before so we are reducing 20 needles 10 from here and 10 from here so i've calculated and distribute the 20 stitches on this needle so let's see one two three four 
5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Those are the 20 needles that is going to take double stitches. So let's go and see how I fix this. So double stitches right here, guys. Then I'm going to fix on single and single. Then another one. Then this needle is taking double stitches. Then the next one. So this is how I will arrange it to all the needles to distribute them to all the needles. So guys, you can see what we have right now. So I'm going to lose up the wasting yarn. So that's it. So guys, I'm going to close with two rows right now. So that's it guys. So I'm going to change my yarn. Do away with this. So I'm going to use green color and set my needle on rib two by one for the sleeve band. Rib two by one right now. So that's, that's it, guys. So I'm going to need 24 rows right now with green color, this color. And I'm using tension 6. So tension 6, guys. Then 24 rows. So that's it, 24. Then I'm going to fold and cast off. So fold it. And cast off so I'm going to need one row right now to save my stitches so I have to do this knitting one row right now with tension 8 then I'm going to cast off loosely So guys, you can see what we have. So you can see what we have as the sleeve right now. So I'm going to repeat that to the other side of the sleeve. So that's what we have. So right now I'm going to go ahead to fix the neck band or knitting machine. I'm going to identify the back area that I'm going to fix right now. So by stretching this and match it together to know where the back neck is going to stop. So here for this place. So I'm going to start from 40 needle. That's 40 needle. Then I'm going to check this side where the neck is going to, the shoulder side is going to stop so that I can know the area for the neck side. So, and this is it here, guys. So, you know, the shaping is 18 by 18 needle so i'm going to go ahead and fix exactly at 18 by 18 needle so it's going to be 36 needle so here is 36 needle so that is from here to here is 36 needle so i start the fixing from 40 then i'm going to extend this one the front side i'm going to you know fix this area right here on this then i'm going to go ahead to 45 needle you know from this side to 45 so the neck is going to take 40 to 45 needle so i'm going to extend this to this area right now and fix so I'm going to fix. So that's it. 
so i'm going to check the center of this and make sure i fix at the center so that the neck fixing will be centralized so that's it then to here so i'm going to start to fix right now the needle is from 40 to 45 so i'm going to use green color and use tension 8 to knit this so i'm going to go ahead and knit one row that's it then the second row right now then i'm going to check the formation of the stitches whether they are okay then i'm going to go ahead and select to rib two by one so guys i'm going to need more 18 rows and fold the neck band then cast off so remember it's tension eight so i'm going to need 18 rows right now so fold So guys you can see what we have after finishing the neck so i'm going to go ahead and fix the second sleeve so that's it guys